So today, I'm moving past Republican obstruction and using the executive authorities available to me as president to do what I can on my own to address the border. Frankly, I would have preferred to address this issue through a bipartisan legislation because that's the only way to actually get the kind of system we have now that's broken, fixed, to hire more Border Patrol agents, more asylum officers, more judges. But Republicans have left me no choice. Today, I'm announcing actions to bar migrants who cross our southern border unlawfully from receiving asylum. Migrants will be restricted from receiving asylum at our southern border unless they seek it after entering through an established lawful process. And those who seek to come to the United States legally, for example, by making an appointment and coming to a port of entry, asylum will still be available to them, still available. But if an individual chooses not to use our legal pathways, if they choose to come without permission and against the law, they'll be restricted from receiving asylum and staying in the United States. This action will help us gain control of our border, restore order to the process. I would, in fact, make sure that there is, we immediately surge to the border. All those people are seeking asylum. They deserve to be heard. That's who we are. We're a nation that says if you want to flee and you're fleeing oppression, you should come. President, what is an border executive action plan? An executive action on the border. Count on the border action happened by itself. The passing. But Congress can't come to an agreement. Well, they haven't yet. They haven't yet. And I'm helping them. Give me the people, give me the people to judge, give me the people.